Maybe in the next area after the haze. Did I open that chest in here? Okay, I want... Nope. Health. Can't see, can't choose, I guess. Oh well, we'll eventually see. Well, we, I was wondering what this was laser was for. Oh no, the statue's crumbling! Or rising. Or I don't know. The place is, whole place is freaking crumbling. Or because he is rising? Yeah, he is rising. Dude down here is like, oh shit. <laughs> Rise without modifying the door. Oh. Let's proceed on. is going to do that. Okay, give me control of my phone. Oh, I can't mess with it anymore. <laughs> it knows everything. Your progress is impressive, Kratos. Okay. But be warned. Once you ascend to the upper levels of the temple, you will not be able to return without Pandora's box. Okay, I know. Send me up. Up, up and away! As Kratos rose through the massive temple constructed to guard Pandora's box, he realized it was a monument not only to the gods of Olympus, but to the madness of the war who had designed him. He'd conquered the lower floors of Pandora's temple, but what lay in wait above would test even the greatest war. Oh great, another boss. Sounds like it. Up, up, away. Where are we? Uh, we're on some hands. Hands are lowering and extending so we can get up here. Hey, there's a. Okay. No nudity, please, no nudity. Dodging my move attack. I wish I had magic. Damn it. Oh, oh, his friend comes in. Two of them, great. Really wish I had magic.
got them both that time except for they didn't die. Die already. Just health. Yeah. A vulture. A vulture with a humanoid head. A harpy. Kratos had been in service to the gods long enough to know the harpy had been sent as a warning, a reminder from his former master of the decision that had cost Kratos everything. Had it been that long since he'd almost met his end at the hands of the barbarians? That long since he'd traded everything to save himself? Ares! The sky split apart, and the god of war stepped through. Descending from Olympus, he saw the makings of a god in a mere mortal. Ares would save Kratos. He would turn him into the perfect warrior, his servant on Earth. Only a simple pledge of loyalty was required. My life is yours, Ares. From this day, I shall carry forth your will. And his fate was sealed. As promised, Ares rescued his new disciple, bringing forth the power of a god. Destroying those who would slaughter Kratos and his men. Ouch. As for Kratos, no mere sword and shield would befit the newest servant of the God of War. The harpies are creepy. Blades of chaos, forged in the foulest depths of Hades. Once attached, the chains remained so, chained and seared to the flesh, a part of the bearer's body, a permanent reminder of Kratos' pledge. In return, ultimate power. The rage of Ares exploded from within. Right, there goes that barbarian's head. But soon, he would learn the true cost of such power. A cost too high even for Kratos to pay. Wretched beast! I know who it is you serve! Return to your master! Tell the god of war I am his no longer. Tell him he is not safe while I walk the earth. I will find Pandora's box. And I will use it to see him tremble and fall before me. Wow, that was weird. Stupid tarpy. They're creepy. Long ass necks and. Ooh, magic, magic, magic. Don't make this mistake again. Woohoo! Magic! Uh, let's see, where am I? The cliffs of Mandus lies before you. In my grieving, I fear I might have designed a maze with no true way out. If I am right, may the cruel, careless gods now show you the way. Care uncaring. Perfect. Once loyal subject of the gods. Uh, yeah. I think anyone would get pissed off after building this whole freaking place, dude. I would, if I was building traps, building all that. Oh, boy. Yep, I'm gonna take a break pile all my videos and just take a break because I'm hungry and stuff so see you guys later on bye